The inspirational Bishop T.D. Jakes is adding two new TV movies to his list, long list of film credits. Lust, a seven deadly sin story, debuted last weekend, and this weekend it's Envy, premiering on Lifetime. And Bishop Jakes joins us now. Good to see you, my friend. It seems like another I lifetime ago that we were we had breakfast together. <laughs> Not I far remember from this that. Day. I had a great time. I did as well, and it's good to see you doing as well as you are. And I have to say, taking on the seven sins as you are, we of course know it's from biblical teachings, readings, but you, you believe it's for everyone, don't you, Bishop? Oh, absolutely. I think anybody can relate to lust and envy and all of the things. It's a human experience. Uh, the proclivity to think that the grass is greener on the other side, uh, we all have had a taste of it. But uh, in this movie, they get a real big gulp of it. They take it to extremes. <laughs> absolutely. And you took on lust this past weekend. And on Saturday, envy, as you say, it's about a woman who has it all. And then she finds out she has a long lost sister. Mm -mm -mm. Gets a little too close for comfort. Here's a look. Absolutely. So precious. My precious daughter. My baby girl. Okay, I'm in. Now, <laughs> tell us, what conversations do you hope will, will, will be sparked because of these movies? I think that we all have a, a tendency to think that we miss something out of life, no matter what station of life that we're in. We have a tendency to think that everybody else's life is better than ours. I, I hope that we'll have a real appreciation for what we have been given, no matter what that is, and who we have been given, and to enjoy the skin we're in, the life we're in, uh, the moment that we have. And uh, it's very entertaining. It's very uh, uh, thrilling, it's power packed, but it's also got a message in it that I hope uh, resonates with the public. And what is the message that you hope that will resonate with the public from the films? Uh, contentment, uh, a sense of self satisfaction, uh, affirmation for oneself, even if your story was difficult mm. or, or challenging, uh, not to think that other people have it better than you and that somehow you've been robbed in some way, to develop an appreciation for self. Uh, I, I hope we walk away with that and avoid the temptation to be envious and trolls on social media oh. and always. Uh, doing the things that we that we do. <laughs> yep, absolutely. Yes, you're speaking truth. And you know that there are, you know, many people are talking about the importance of representation and you are executive producer. How important is it to have everyone have a space to tell their stories? I think it's incredibly important. We have a very diverse uh, cosmopolitan country with uh, different people from different walks of life. And it is far better when we tell our own stories rather than to have people explain who we are. They do a very poor job of doing that. And as we attempt to become uh, the melting pot that we profess to be, uh, giving a voice to every individual to express uh, the diversity, even within, say, the black community, there's a great deal of diversity. We're not a monolith. And, and sometimes, historically, we have been portrayed only in one vacuum, mm -hmm. and I think it adds to the density and the toxicity that exists in the country today racially. And this gives us an opportunity to say, uh, we're just like you. We have all types of people. We have all types of ideas. And judge me not by how I appear, but by how I am. Amen to that. Hey, we, uh, did you see we had your daughter on yesterday? talking about her brand yes, new book. Yes, I loved it. <laughs> yeah. it's what, you know, so, so your daughter yesterday, you today, it says a lot about your family, Bishop Jakes, and how you, you want to be of service to others, doesn't it? Yes, uh, you know, to have raised our children, all of our children are grown now, and to see Sarah uh, spread her wings and fly and, and follow in the footsteps of really uplifting and encouraging people, ministering, preaching, uh, doing books, uh, uh, appearing in films, she's done some of everything at such a young age. 
She's beautiful on the outside and on the inside, and I was so proud of her. And to be on GMA, I mean, you know, <laughs> I'm proud of me being on GMA. <laughs> well, you give her a fine example to follow. Thank you. Thank you, Bishop. Thank you so much, TD, Robin. It's I, a pleasure. It's a pleasure. I hope we can have breakfast again, break bread again I'm, at some I point. I look forward to it. I do as well, sir. Be well. NV, a, a seven Deadly Sin Story premieres Saturday at 8, 7 Central on Lifetime. And an encore presentation on Lust is on right before. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.